Hello everyone, it's the old comic collector. Another unboxing for you. Two boxes again, two small ones. Let's get into it, let's see what's in the boxes. Straight into this one. Cardboard mailer. And boarded, we have got Marvel Spotlight 28, first solo series for Moon Knight. Of course, he appeared first in Werewolf by Night 32, really big book at the moment. This is his first solo series, well, first solo appearance. Two issues Marvel Spotlight 28 and 29, um, and then he pops up in his own self-named series Moon Knight in 1980 I believe it is. Um, so nice looking book obviously we have got some spine spine damage going on there. This book is climbing actually in price. Um, I thought it was time to pick pick it up. Let's get it out the bag. Have a proper look. Another lovely self-sealing bag again. My favourites. You've got to be very careful when you take them out. <clears throat> okay. Now I don't know if you can pick it up on camera um, <clears throat> with the uh, glare there, but there's uh, quite a lot of creasing on this cover, which will and can be pressed out. Probably hard to pick up. I'm trying to tilt it with the light, but it is there. Uh, quite a lot of creasing. Seeing down the side there. Got a bit of a crumpled corner on that one, but it's not too bad. Creasing down the edge as well. You can feel that creasing as well. Um, I don't mind that because I should be able to press that out on the back. That's not too bad. Could do with a clean. Let's see dirt, dirt along the top there. Backs are usually cleaner, better than the fronts. And I can only think that's because the front side of the book is always laid front side up and it gets the worst wear that backs always seem to look better. The only thing you do get is the dirt down the whites of these Bronze Age books, but that could be cleaned. Um, yeah, it's not half so much creasing on that one than there is on the front. Nice looking book though. I uh, picked this up for £37.50, including postage. I think it's around a 7 0. Um, I'll have a better look if I think it's any different. I'll pop it on the screen. Um, and again, once it's had a press, that's what I was thinking of, 7-0. You may think differently. Pop it in the comments. Let me know what you think. Marvel Spotlight 28. So he doesn't look bad. Doesn't look bad for his age. A nice old comic. Down there, second box. Let's get into it. Found a seam. Cut into that very carefully. Always a bit wary because you never know what is inside and how it's wrapped inside the box. This one, however, better wrap inside. Dragon board. Nice cardboard mailer. Let's get into that. Recycle the, uh, the bubble wrap. If I'm sending anything out. I recycle all my cardboard mailers as well. They will get reused. I'm selling any books on eBay. That's what they go out in. Sellotaped to another piece of card. Really good packaging. This is in a top loader. 
You can see why when you see what it is. It's a Hulk 180 by Sean Rule book. Let's take him out very carefully. There we go. Hook 180. First cameo appearance of Wolverine. Let's make sure he is in here. Here's on the last page. Um, the other thing with this book, a lot of the books around this, this uh, time, make sure the Marvel value stamp is still on the page. Usually in the letters pages, make sure no one's snipped it out. A lot of kids in the day used to do that. Um, 1974, of course. Probably the worst thing with this book, you've got a line going down, down the book. It's almost like a crease. Maybe it is. Could keep the grade down. I had this down as a 7 0. If you can just see that, someone's written something, looks like it's been pressed through. Um, another book, crease wise, yeah, some crease in there can be pressed. We'll see how that improves that line. Apart from that, a little bit of mark in there edge isn't too bad. Some ticks. Some ticks. Let's see. Let's see what a press and a clean does for this one. Uh, paid uh, 554 for this one. I think that crease is going to keep it around around that uh, around that grade. I think it's a 5.5. A five. bit more, a bit less. Let me know in the comments, see what you think. Um, again, this is a book that's climbing at the moment, um, and that's without having any Wolverine in the MCU or in Disney Plus or anywhere at the moment. Pick it up now if you can. And there we go. Um, again, I'll have a proper look at this. If I think the grade's any different, I'll pop it up on the screen. You can just see there where I'm holding it. You can see some creasing on the cover. So we'll give that a press, see if we can... Uh, that'll flatten out. Flatten out nicely. It's not a bad looking book. Okay, there we go. That's the end of our short eBay haul unboxing. Um, bit of Wolverine, bit of Hulk, and a bit of Moon Knight. Uh, look out for further videos. If you like it, give me a thumbs up, subscribe, leave comments, uh, anything you'd like to see, anything you'd like me to do differently, put it down in the comments, let me know. It's all good. I'll see you soon. Take care.